Alright guys, so what's up? Finally back to those big got a really, 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 really I'm quick to come out video. I wanted to do a really quick I know it's a Vegeta battle right there for all the air. But I did this really quick stuff I wanted to go over the really quick. Hopefully I won't trust you too long in this video or more and more or whatever, but I'm gonna jump right in. We got some pretty good um, new news right here for both Google and JP, of course. I both of these events are moving at the same time for both Global and JP. I don't know yet though. I, mean, I think it's several Global is gonna be. Um, in a couple more days, but yeah, I think it said, um, since the Joker Festival is gonna leave, um, in a couple more days, it's gonna be available for, um, I think it's like, I think it's all the bonus time, I think, like, what, I think, like, not 11, I know 11, uh, I know 11 is like, I think, like, 22 or 23, um, cause I know yesterday, for global times, of course, yesterday, yeah, like, the whole, you know, global link update, which I did, I'll put it somewhere around here, I don't want to upload these videos in order, though, I don't know, I'm gonna probably upload them in order, in the next couple of days, I mean, it's coming out Saturday, Sunday, whatever time, time zone you guys are in, or whatever, but yeah, um, I was gonna say those events are leaving though, by the way, so this is the Vegeta event, the um, OG Vegeta event from the um, 30th anniversary, and the LR Vegeta, and Vegeta, and for Bruhan, this is like his fourth Goku Fest in a row, honestly. Um, yeah, they said um, it was Goku, it was Vegeta, and Bruhan, so basically this is kind of confirming, maybe not confirmation yet, but we are getting LR Vegeta and Bruhan at this point. I don't know if it's gonna be specifically Bruhan, it might be like a Super Boo that goes, because you know, the last couple of Goku Fest have been Super Boo, you know, it's, uh, it's Bruhan and Super Boo, we'll probably get like another, like, you know, new LR. Or and stuff like that from Super Boo all the way down to Kid Boo. It's probably like that again, just kind of copy and paste into that event. I say I do like the event back in the day, I hated it, but nowadays it's perfect for like test runs and stuff like that. You, can, um, you take a longer on that event and stuff like that, you know, you have a lot of turns and stuff like that. Um, yeah, some stuff like that, of course, but yeah, um, that's kind of that's gonna kind of it for it being there though, specifically. But yeah, again, though, this event and stuff like that, it should be going away in a couple more days. Um, I want to say the time right there is like. Um, I think it's, um, oh yeah, I think we're on Eastern time, by the way, so yeah, for you guys, it might be different for me. This is, on, oh yeah, August, oh yeah, August, August 26th, because I know, at least at, I think at the time of recording, I know next Friday, um, at this time, I think around this time, next Friday-ish, not this time specifically, but around this, like, you know, time area, um, for, like, you know, Friday and stuff like that, we'll be in the Dokken now, so when this clock down here hits, um, 8-28, um, um, 2020, um, that's how, um, they're really gonna get the new Dokken now, so you know, Dokken live stream, and, you know, for JP, and for Dokken, it's gonna be, for, for the Oval, it's gonna be Dokken now, that's been announced for, um, cool books, stuff like that, again, I'll link that somewhere, I'll link, the, um, I have that video already ready, and stuff like that, I just have to, you know, I just have to have it already ready to upload, or, you know, if, it's, if it is already uploaded to the channel, because I know at times of recording I'm doing right now, I do not have those videos edited, they'll be edited and stuff like that when I'm done. But I was gonna say, though, of course, specifically, though, Again, these guys are just leaving stuff like that. Kind of confirming that we're going to get Bruhan and stuff like that pretty much on there. Um, Bruhan is Super Vegeta. So, again, we don't know how the physical is structure and stuff like that. It's just a leak, you know, it's kind of like a rumor just going around and stuff like that. I kind of don't want to make this video out. Not to spoil or go for anything like that, because I don't know. We don't know. I'm just making a video on this. I'm like, oh yeah, new LR Vegeta and Bruhan incoming? You know, confirm or something like that. You know, confirm, question mark, question mark, question mark. That's how I like to do it. You know, kind of get, I gotta, you know, make the title. I had dragging people, not clickbait, but I got to kind of go dragging people, plug into some stuff, you know. But yeah, again, though, like, you're um, Central Eastern Time, or, you know, Central, yeah, Central Eastern Time, that's going to be structured, so maybe a little bit later at night and stuff like that. I know the time, I know, so I know 23, um, 00 is, um, 11 o'clock, so, 11, 12, it might be, I want to say, like, um, maybe 12 o'clock, I want to say? Um, no, no, 12, 11. I'm trying to think 10, 9, 8, 9, 7, 6, I want to say maybe like 3 o'clock, 2 o'clock, that's how um, it's kind of structured, no it isn't, and maybe like, uh, I want to say like 11, maybe 4 or 5 p.m., that's how it's usually going to be structured, or probably like a 3 p.m. or 11 p.m., that's how I usually get these events out, because I hear Gohan stuff came out on the 29th of August, and they were on, um, but this is probably like a little 20, 3rd, 23rd, I mean 21st, um, August, that sounds so stupid, on the 30th of August, or, you know, the, does August have a, I have to check my date real quick, let me check, I, I don't want to check it on video, though, I never really do that, um, I can't go later, I want to click, I want to I know it's August 31st, is it, I might be tripping, okay, okay, so August 31st, I kind of we'll get the live stream next Friday, so make sure your timers, um, Friday 20, uh, Friday, um, August 28th, 2020, we're gonna get that, so, probably, like, on the 29th, Maybe, probably Monday, I decide, the 31st, I'll get to see that, I'll go Vegeta, Vegeta, I'm gonna go for the banners, and stuff like that, typical stuff, of course, um, but yeah, again, we should see these guys updated and stuff like that, I'm gonna talk about them in a second, like I said, we do actually get a new confirmation for this new stone right here, 
Um, I think this is the new stone that I went over in my breakdown video for the chain battle. I wasn't gonna, I was gonna kind of drag it off in this video as well. But I'm kind of going to do items and stuff like that. I think, um, I kind of found this randomly on the Reddit. But I was gonna say though, um, ooh, actually I did not crack there. But I was gonna say though, um, honestly, um, we should see this later on in the game and stuff like that. I know, stretch a minute video. Yeah, I was using, I used to stretch a lot. But I was gonna say though, we should see the new item in the game sooner or later, personally though. Because this is a new item and stuff like that. I probably the new item, you know. Where you have to use 50 stones in the game. You know, for every 50 stones you use in the game, you get this item right here. Um, you can select like whatever jumper face unit you want. They're kind of doing that differently because last year, you know, for every 50 stones you use, you get tickets. This year, they're kind of changing it up there where we have like, you know, regular tickets and stuff like that in this stone. Uh, it's not probably purchasable, but if it is purchasable, um, maybe, I don't know, it's gonna be short trip, but yeah, again, for every 50 stones you use in the game, I guess it's giving you a stone item. If this is a chrono crystal, just copy and paste it. What I do like is that it's like a blue, like purple and blue stone kind of mixed together. Um, I kind of like that though. Um, so, you know, a different type of stone and stuff like that, a different type of currency, I guess. But yeah, it's kind of cool out there. Um, but yeah, I guess it's gonna be a new item for every, again, for every 50 stones you use in the game, you're gonna see this, um, you get probably see this in your gift box or whatever, because I will go over it when it comes out and stuff like that. I always do it no matter what. Um, because, you know, these are, um, actually, I want to mention those as well, um, for this, right here. Oh, these are just some regular missions you can do every single day. I guess, like, this is going to be up for the whole, um, the celebration and stuff like that. Person those just doing this every single day, logging in every day. So, you know, some people want to go, you know, people can always kind of force, you know, force off their game and stuff like that. Where it's basically like, okay, I'm going to log in a week later and get my bonus prizes back. And I can also get this as well, though. They want, you know, they want you to log in every day so you can get these things. So, they kind of want you to do it, though. It's quest, you can do it basically quest or events only once. They got log in every day. Again, doing quest or event, especially right now, again, if you're looking at, if you're doing the new system for global, the very last quest stage is good and the ambitious androids um it's i think it's area 27 and area 24 you want to do those so you can get you can get gems as you're grinding up links your links the skill links and stuff like that and go and jp because they're both are out right now and the rise of bandit is up right now from jp i don't know if it is or not but you know i like the campaign and stuff like that um if you want to burn with the rides event that's available and stuff like that, you want to do that to fight the Cyberman in one the stage, stage three. You fight the Cyberman and basically you may get more on. They come up, you can, you find the last Cyberman, you want to fight them on purpose because there's a lot, I think it's like one whole row where you literally, where you literally are fighting like a whole bunch of Cybermen in a row. I think it's like, I think the area is kind of like you can kind of get it, you kind of can't, it's like RNG based kind of where it's locked off and not locked off. You can go to that and basically from up that, like just from up that and straight get, um, you know, and you won't get hurt or nothing like that. And basically you have like blue fusions or, you know, Characters like, or if you want from all your um, world tournament AOEs, get a good leader from all your tournament AOEs, which I probably will do honestly later and stuff like that. So you can basically uh, from out, get the mixture up and stuff like that. And that's what I'm gonna personally do so I can make them stronger and stuff like that. Then more attack power and stuff like that. You don't get the power. Never really defensive because in world tournament you don't want to get hurt or hit a lot because you will die. Honestly, like from one, two hit. Unless you have like tankers like two, three, three, three. Um, Vegeta, Tech Golden for like any go any of the Golden Freezes like Tech. I'm um, not in though. I know AGL and Tech. It's gonna get hurt a lot. Um, tech, I say it are really good. Jinna, but if you really want to get a dodge factor in, but I know because a lot of people do want like villains, move villains, and stuff like that. You know, like movie villains, resurrected warriors, they know LR pros and all those categories. Any category is good, Pierce Haynes, anybody runs those. But yeah, again, these are separate tickets from, the, from this banner. And this is for, this is for, for both Global and JP right here. The ticket banner right here. I'm gonna score it down. This is a JP banner though, by the way. Um, it has chunks as a monster and global does not. It's the exact, the same exact banner on global and JP. It's just that I know LR is on here as well. Oh, I had um, the things right here. So yeah, I know all the LR is on here as well. We have Baby, Vegeta, um, those are chunks of Pan. I don't think LR can click on here. I think all the classic LRs are on here from like, you know, from year four and beyond. I know LR can click on on here, but it may, maybe they're not just loaded up on here. I know it's a JP banner because that's Topo. Um, it has Topo, um, Krillin, and the Supreme Kai, so, and Vados, so, and Global has Vados as well now, so that's really good, though, honestly, that's really good if you're trying to hunt down for those units. But, well, specifically for me, for this banner, I don't really need nobody on here besides, um, Jungle Pest Piccolo, it's weird, because, yeah, Jungle Pest Piccolo kind of shocked me, too, I was like, he's on here? It's really great, because I don't have him, he's really good, I honestly wouldn't mind getting him. I don't want, I really want one more dupe for talking about Super Broly, I know I got hit in Broly the big last tickets, so this year, I know, I usually get what I want to take advantage of. A lot. See, this is the 50 stone, this is a 50 stone version. 50, um, this is probably gonna be a stone version of it, like it was last year, where you basically have to do summoning. Or, you know, a couple of days later, before it ends, we're gonna see a ticket banner and stuff like that. Um, a stone version of that banner. Do not summon on those banners. I think before the demo celebration usually starts, um, we're gonna kind of see it in a worldwide um, campaign, whatever, however you want to call it. We're both global and campaign. But yeah, again, this is both, this is both, go, for both live, for both global, for both global and JP. My words getting mixed up. No, I kind of like, eh, just, eh. Uh, or it's getting mixed up. But yeah, 
I'm making the same banner and stuff like that for Bobo. Just Trunks and Mossy on, on here. Makes sense though, kind of, because you know Trunks and Mossy. They came out a little bit later on, late on, uh, a little bit later on Global than JP. But I'm glad Kid Goku's on here. I do not have him. Um, I, I don't have Goku as Piccolo or Namek Goku or Transforming Frieza or Android 17 or the Blue Cow King Goku down here and um, Vegeta. So Vegeta's on here. So yeah, yeah those are the only ones I don't have. And Angel, and Angel Golden Frieza. I completely forgot about him. I just forgot about him because everybody else I have already. I have Ink Goku Black. I have Super Blue. I just got him. Um, again, I like the screen for the units I don't have. I have Royal Rainbow, I not need him. I have hit already. I have Goku Black on this rainbow. Um, I have Kuro. I, I think beforehand, I know last year I pulled... Yeah, it's, almost, yeah, it's been almost a year since I pulled this guy. I pulled... Camera was up on here. Am I been Future Gohan? I think I pulled him on here. Um, I, I think I pulled Jiren on here as well. Yeah, so yeah, this is the only user I'm really technically missing. But yeah, Goku and JP, this is the ticket banner. Again, a lot of people like to ask how to get the 55th ticket, how to get the 50th ticket, because you can have 50 tickets. I think it's an issue because this, this campaign ticket is the same one as the 50, 50th ticket right here. They're the exact same one. So you can save up 50 tickets and, you know, wait. Um, it's something like, you know, get 50 units from um, from this banner and stuff like that. It's the exact same banner. It doesn't really matter though, but if you really want to save up, like, I'm probably going to do it anyway, because I always, always save up until the very last game summon. You get 50 tickets and stuff like that. If you basically don't feel like going, you know, if you don't feel like doing, you know, seven multis, which I kind of like yeah, about the banner too, but it's a little bit different. But basically, if you just want, you know, it's basically like the 55th LR banner, which I kind of predicted was going to kind of come like this. But basically, it's like, okay, you can use on um, 50, you can save up 50 tickets if you want to. Save up 50, and boom, summon on this banner. It's going to take some time though, because a lot of people are going to ask, how do you get the 50th ticket? How do you get the 50th ticket? How do you get the 50th ticket? I'm glad I'm not get spam with those um, stuff. Um, but I know one of my friends is going to ask me that too. It's like, oh my gosh. Yeah, again, he goes, you guys, you got to be patient. You got to wait and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, and to make Goku, I don't have him either. So a lot of units are missing on the banner, and Piccolo, of course. But yeah. And just from Increase, I have Goku. I got him last year. I'm not interested in Freeza at all. He's still good though. I really wouldn't mind him. But again, this is both for, for both Obo and JP. Again, you have an option to save these tickets. These are the same ones as these. We basically log in and stuff like that. We're basically the log in, get, um, you know, log in every day, do quests and stuff like that. Again, we'll probably see these, we'll probably come out and do like the whole celebration. This is definitely going to be part one and two. They had one last year. Maybe part three, but I doubt it though, because you know it's going to last from now to September. Like, again, the down celebrations usually, usually last from now, from now to December. So, in December. If that was the case, this would be a long campaign, five parts. From now until August, um, October, until the beginning, the beginning of October. So that's when we're probably seeing the like, best unit and stuff like that. I know that's when the weather kind of starts to get kind of cold because of the air and stuff like that. But you know, with the whole global virus crisis going around, probably not going to be a fair this year. Will this stay fair? But yeah. Um, like I said, for the Gogeta and Vegito events, this house is going to be structured, though. I'm um, going to have another Dragon Quest event on top of this one. Um, for Global, it's going to be kind of weird, because, no, not for this one, because we're going to definitely see, you know, um, you probably you like, use these, this Vegito down here, probably, then they're going to use a new, um, you know, like a new Vegito, like a new, it's going to be like a new LR, probably the LR from the last event. Um, then, like, you know, the LR and stuff like that. Again, this, this house is going to be structured, it's going to be from this event, though, so we're going to see a new Vegito, um, and you'll probably be base form Vegeta, a Goku and Vegeta that goes into base form Vegito. And for Boo, it's kind of weird because in the context of him, this is his fourth Doka Fest. For Bulbas, this is third. For JV, this is his fourth. Because the Boo Han event, um, they, they used this Boo Metal from the, um, is this Doka Fest Boo down here? It was. Yeah, this Doka Fest Boo down here. Um, yeah, they kind of stopped the trend right there. Um, yeah, because the Boo, yeah, because, yeah, a lot of units do wake up from this event, by the way. Like, I think it's probably the one of the most Doka Fest Metals they used for the event. So yeah, like all the other boos, like you know, Super Boo, from Super Boo, Boo Han, they all don't come wake from this event and stuff like that. So yeah, Hercule down there. Um, that's how they all structured and stuff like that. So yeah, um, for Global, they don't we don't have this Doka Fest event. It's gonna be in November for Global. So yeah, um, not after the down celebration, but a month after the down celebration, after October ends. Because well, again, I will we'll make an overall overview for both for both the Global and JP for the um, down celebration stuff. Yeah, but I was gonna say though, um, for this Super Boo, it's gonna be in November for Global. So. Um, it's gonna be weird if they're gonna have the LR. I think they're gonna probably keep the LR, because LR art and stuff like that on here. They usually do that for mobile. They don't change it around like they do on the Ducking Wiki right here. It's gonna be like the, it's probably like the new, newest LR art for mobile, like for the third one right here. They may keep this one for global permanently, or they might have the LR one. Again, they'll probably have the LR one on here, the newest LR one permanently. Then, like, you know, have the new, and then when the boot comes out, they're gonna probably swap it out. I don't know how they're gonna do it. They're gonna have, probably have the new LR art. It's gonna be like, you know, the third one for the boot and metals and stuff like that. I'm actually gonna do it for them a little bit. So yeah, for Boo and stuff like that, like that Boo right there, for him, I want to say they're probably going to change it for Global and stuff like that. Or they're going to keep the LR one, they're going to probably teach it as art, and then they're going to tease him, you know, being the, um, the LR one will probably be there. 
again, how they're gonna awaken and stuff like that, and there's gonna be the LF blue fusions and stuff like that. They're kind of going down the route. And go on itself from last year as well, they're gonna be structured like that. Um, we're basically right here. They're gonna take the new Dokkafest metals. Like, for example, this is new, this is the new Vegeta blue metals. I kind of believe we, I kind of believe we're, I did pick Vegeta on here because he was just on here and stuff like that. Weird I did it, but I'm kind of glad I did it also, because we gave the example. So I know everybody's going to be tired of Vegeta, 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 we get a new one every year. You now we got like a new base form, you know, new Vegeta goes with the Super War, you know, we just got Blue Vegeta. You know, first it's like Super Vegeta, then like a Blue Vegeta. Um, but yeah, he's going to be like from the Blue Wars and stuff like that, not from here, because he's not, not going to have time travelers and stuff like that. Um, or Future Saga. Yeah, this is how it's going to be structured. It's going to take a new, he's going to take the new medals, the new blue, his, his new medals and stuff like that. For Buhan and, um, Gogeta. For Buhan and um, Vegito, um, they're gonna take him, his new medals, they're gonna take another of his new medals, and then his old event. So we're gonna see his old medal event um, right here. We're gonna use this one to joke away him to LR. That's how it's gonna be structured and stuff like that. Still iconically weird, still iconically, iconically weird, I brought this Vegito up. Just weird, I didn't bring the Blue Fusion up because I use them a lot. I use the Blue Fusion art a lot in my um, other videos and stuff like that. Okay, yeah, I kinda noticed that for every video. I, I, can't, I can't remember on top of my head all my videos. Um, really, I chose this Vegeta part. Kind of weird, but at the same time, it's like, oh yeah, I know everybody's gonna be like, oh, he chose Vegeta. Oh, he's your favorite fusion hypersonic. Yeah, he is, of course. But I love Gogeta and Vegeta equally. I like them both. Honestly, I love Super Gogeta. I love Vegeta. I love them both, honestly. I love Vegeta a little bit more, but I like them both, honestly. I don't care anymore. I, I can confirm I love them both. I can take either or, honestly. I like them both. But yeah, I mean, it's gonna be structured and stuff like that. They're gonna take like, the newest Doka Fest medals, um, then they can take the newest one, then the old one. That's how it's gonna be structured. And gone, so like that last year as well. But yeah, like, look, new Doka Fest event, um, new one, then the old one. The old Cell Games event. Same goes for Cell. New one, um, new one, and old one. So yeah, that's how it's gonna be structured and stuff like that for these guys. But yeah, again, that's all we want to do today. Again, they're really short, more short of a video, though, like I said. Um, again, for these tickets and stuff like that, again, these are the same tickets as these ones where you can do them, like, you know, missions from them and stuff like that every single day. Um, basically, you can save them up to 50 and stuff like that. That's how I'm, how I'm about to do it, so, you know, I just go through all those multis. Because, again, um, again, you don't have to do them if you don't want to. But, you know, because seven, you know, seven tickets on, but it's better seven, you know, you get, like, you know, I think, like, ten units and stuff like that, or, you know, seven units, that's, that's how it's going to be structured. But if you want to get them all up into one, if you really feel like it, you don't feel like going through all those multis and stuff like that. But I'll probably do that personally myself. Um, you can basically save them up to 50 and stuff like that, you know. It, it'll probably get, end up getting more than 50, you know, hitting number one in the app store and stuff like that. I think last year we hit, like, what, number one, like, four times. They had, like, over a thousand stones from, like, the suggestion, the campaign, and stuff like that, for both Global and JP alone from last year. We're enough to get us almost a thousand. And, of course, no last year and stuff like that. We had really good prizes for number one in the app store, so yeah. And this, this is for both Global and JP. Of course, we got the new stone. Um, you know, for every 50 zones using the game, we're gonna definitely see this in the, um, you know, as a lot of the most, you know, exchange item we're gonna get and stuff like that. You just, like, probably one of these Joker Fest units and stuff like that from this banner probably they never really do it like my red coins and stuff like that because i remember last year everybody was like everybody was like oh yeah red coins we can you know with in the some version of the red account it's like oh yeah we can get all these guys red coins i think a lot of people were sad about that last year and they were like oh man we can't get them so i guess this year we're kind of doing it like this also though they do they cut and paste all these units from here to there that's how it's gonna be structured but yeah again david's gonna have trophies and also global will not it kind of doesn't make sense within the time frames and stuff like that but yeah really gonna go ahead and video here again more of a shorter one this time around though but, yeah um, again, um, that's how we, that's how it's gonna be structured and stuff like that, these guys. Uh, so again, um, Super Vegeta and Buhan kind of confirmed, maybe not. Again, though, you know, because events are leaving. This could be nothing after all, you know, when, um, we got our LR Jiren leaks last, um, you know, LR Jiren, technically. Um, a lot of people were like, oh yeah, um, you know, uh, like, oh yeah, um, I think when Blue Kai can go through, uh, Blue Kai can go through Evolution Blue Vegeta first came out, everybody was like, oh yeah, LR Jiren confirmed, I mean, you for part two. Part two, you know, he came out a week later and stuff like that, sure. But the only reason his event was around is because that, I mean, he took Doku Fest medals from Jiren's Doku Fest event, a Doku making them to brew physical, the physical blue pop and blue Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta. I did take notes from those events, but yeah. Um, again, that's all we really want to go to today. Again, so, what do you guys think about this? You know, I love Vegeta and Buhan confirmed. Again, we don't know. They could just give obviously mean nothing at all at the end of the day. Could be nothing, could be something, we don't know, but yeah. That's how the mills are gonna be structured, that's how the units are gonna awaken. That's a full ticket banner and a new course exchange item. We gotta get every creature to don't use in the game. But then back then, from this time it was last year to now and stuff like that, you know, because they had a countdown and stuff like that last year. On the 19th, I know today's like the 21st, so yeah, kinda of a few days later, but yeah. Um I guess you know, last year was early, this year's kinda of, you know, you know, getting it late. 
probably do it on the 31st, you know, last year, early this year, late. Make sure it's probably going to be early again. So, yeah. Um, you know, we didn't get the loops until like way later, but yeah. So, um, yeah. So, see you guys later, though. Thank you so much for watching. Great day for the Oku Jump. So, what do you guys think about this? I love it, you know, Buhan confirmed pretty much almost. So, what do you guys think, though? Of course, yeah. See you guys later, though. Again, though. Peace out.